You've heard us talk about this onshore flow we've been stuck in the last couple of weeks. The winds blowing it off the Gulf each morning, keeping the coast very warm in the mornings and pushing all the rain east of I-75 during the afternoons. That's caused two things. Number one, a huge disparity between who's gotten the rain so far this month. Tampa is behind where we should be for this time of year, while Lakeland is ahead because you've seen numerous showers and storms. The coast also on pace for its warmest July on record because of temperatures in the 80s every single morning. That changes later on this week as an offshore flow begins pushing the rain back towards the beaches and hopefully also cooling us off each morning. Updates on your forecast always available at Greg D. Weather on Twitter.